well, this is Gunsnipe's nice watches. And, of course, it's summertime. Bugs are out this day or the other. Of course, it's back to school season. So, this may not be as applicable. But in any given situation, you're going to have to protect and not only make yourself comfortable. So, as far as the protection part of it, Sawyer SPF 30 sunscreen has been about the best sunscreen that my family has been able to use at any price. Um, it says, you know, non-greasy, comfortable to wear. Discover the Sawyer difference. Bonding base formula, da 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 SPF 30. Really, there's nothing more than SPF 30 uh, in reality as far as as far as real sunscreen. What this doesn't do, it doesn't clog up your pores. It's a very scientific approach to making actual sunscreen instead of uh, making something that just smells good or, or this, that, or the other. Um, and Sawyer does that with all of their products. We've had their Sawyer, you know, the Squeeze, the Sawyer Mini, da-da-da-da-da. Well, they do this, bring the same technology and level of understanding uh, to their sunscreens. And this, of course, is an 8-ounce version. This is what I carry in my backpack. It's probably more than most people do. Um, this is my kind of a slack packing backpack or one that I just go out during the day. EDC type carry. Now, when I'm out in the woods and I want a little bit of bug protection... I use the Sawyer Maxi DEET. This is 100% DEET. Um, but it's still in a... It, it, there's still a difference. All 100% DEETs aren't, aren't created equal. Of course, this is a 4 fluid ounce just in a spray bottle. Uh, it's probably the most economical way of buying it. If you buy it in the little uh, 1 ounce uh, spray pens, those things get really expensive. Um, and I tend to use too much of this stuff or use it very frequently. It doesn't take very much. You just spray it on your skin, wipe it in, and it works. A product that Sawyer actually has created that I'm going to start and try out and test and this, there, or the other is the so uh, Sawyer 30% DEET, um, but it's in a lotion base. Um, this is a 3-ounce bottle. Um, which everybody knows I, I tend to go out with my family. So I have to have, you know, one ounce balls not going to last me very long uh, when five people are, in, are using it relatively um, frequently. This says it lasts eight hours, da 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 da. But we'll see how this works. Um, one thing that I have noticed is it's in a, uh, the base on it is very you know i hate to sit there and say this this stuff's really not bad for your skin um feels very comfortable da 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 and it'll go through all the different types of stuff first aid in case you get it in your eyes which you don't get it in your eyes which the way you get it in your eyes is if you install if you uh, wipe it on yourself and then you wipe your hands uh, your eyes with your hands which should be something that people get out of the uh, habit of doing but these are three products that I've used and uh, stand behind I know there's a lot of hype out there uh, one thing that I don't like about DEET products and this is the thing that always has scared me is of course DEET is some some pretty bad stuff uh, but when you mix like a 30% DEET in an alcohol based solution that alcohol actually is uh, of course soluble and actually makes you absorb more of it the base on this insect 30 without getting into a lot of science actually um, is a delivery agent it actually holds the DEET and then disperses it over time as it basically uh, breaks down on the skin so you don't get that absorption um, in times where there's really bad mosquitoes, of course, the 100% DEET in a simple spray, 4 fluid ounce is the one I buy. Of course, this is a 3 fluid ounce and an 8 fluid ounce uh, 
sunscreen you can get this sunscreen in a one fluid ounce and i've got some on the way it'll probably be here this afternoon just for a convenience thing um i got a really good uh had a really good coupon uh, electronic coupon so i thought i'd give a one ounce a try um and then i'll try to refill it out of an eight ounce but anyway this is the Sawyer line of products, and these are the, the ones that I'm using right now and that I would stake my uh, my my life and my family's life on it, uh, which some people say I'll, I'll stake my life on that. That's really not saying much because uh, I don't, you know, I don't really worry so much about my safety, uh, my security, this, there, or the other, but of my children, I really do, and I try to use the very best products on them and have them... Uh, have the highest level of safety, protection, and uh, convenience. And these products uh, deliver that. I'm excited to see how the uh, lotion uh, works. I know I'm probably not the first person to make a video on these. Um, but this is where I'm at. Uh, this is what I do. I went through my house and threw away all the other uh, deep based like the off and uh, got rid of all the old sunscreen and everything else that we had the problem with sunscreen though is you know there's really not anything stronger than SPF 30 when they start labeling it that way it uh, kind of starts to scare me uh, <laughs> Because uh, that's basically getting it at what a shirt, a lot of shirts are SPF 50 and you understand how much blocking capability they have. Uh, most people don't apply things correctly and if they are applying them correctly, they'll clog your pores, they'll do all kinds of things and they're just uh, the, little, the nasty bits. SPF 30 is about where I'm at and I believe the technology and everything else uh, supports uh, the use of SPF 30. Anyway, it's good for your skin. It's good for you. Uh, da 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 da. Just don't eat it. Um, and Maxi Deet, as I said, it's 100% Deet, but it's a little bit different than all other 100% Deets. Uh, it doesn't have this, the odor. Doesn't have this. Doesn't have that. Uh, how they do that, I have no idea. Uh, I I have talked to some people, and they say they do it actually through a refining. This is a more refined Deet. Um, so it's basically the difference between diesel fuel and kerosene. You know, kerosene is just a high, highly, highly refined uh, diesel fuel. Which is why the Whisperlite stoves will run off, the Whisperlite International is designed to run off kerosene, uh, unleaded fuel, or diesel. Um, don't know that I would run off diesel, but uh, I would definitely go for kerosene <laughs> or white gas. Anyway... This is Guns and Eyes Watches. Have a good one. Peace out.